All right, so I just got done scuba diving, and this is the best find of the day, man. This is crazy, dude. I can't believe I found a pistol in the river. Every time I find a weapon in the river, we always call the police just because this weapon or any other weapon I find could be used in an open criminal case, and it could help somehow in some case, and that's why I always hand over these weapons. But for the most part, every time I hand over a pistol to a police officer, they say they most likely won't be able to get anything off of this just because it's been in the river for a long time. Right here it says 380 ACP, model CF380. I think that's where the old serial number used to be, and it looks scratched off or rusted off, so I don't know what they can get out of this there's no clip right here but it could be loaded so i'm gonna treat it as it's loaded but right now i'm gonna leave this right here i'm gonna hop into the truck call the police and we'll go from there but man i can't believe it dude we actually found a real pistol in the river and this right here most definitely looks like a potential murder weapon man this is unreal we're gonna call the phoenix city police department and we're gonna see what we need to do from here i'm not calling 911. this isn't an emergency so i'm just gonna call the police department Hey, how you doing? My name's Jake. I found uh, a weapon in a river while scuba diving and I want to hand it over to the police. Okay, just a minute, please. Yes, ma'am. This is always so exciting, man, to call the police, to have them come down and get the gun. Like, it's just so cool. All right, so they transferred me to someone else in the department, I guess. 
but man, I'm excited. Phoenix City Police Department, this is Minnie. How can I help you? Hey, how you doing? My name's Jake. Uh, while I was scuba diving in the Chattahoochee River, I actually found a pistol, and I want to hand it over to the police. Okay, you, you found it in the water? Yes, ma'am. But I got out on the Phoenix City side. Should I call the Columbus, Georgia Police Department, or should I remain here? Yeah, anything that's in the water is going to be Columbus City jurisdiction. Okay, even though I got out of the water on the Alabama side? Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, anything like in the water is still their jurisdiction. All right, sounds good. I didn't know that. All right, I'll go ahead and call Columbus Police Department, and then uh, we'll go from there. Thank you so much for your time. So we're back on the Georgia side now. If you guys didn't know, the river is actually divided. One side's Georgia, and the other side is Alabama, and the river is, I guess, owned by Georgia. I think the Columbus Police Department is actually closed. I think it closes after 5. It's 5.15. So with that said, I'm going to call 911 right now, and right off the back, I'm going to say it's not an emergency, and then I'm going to tell them, you know, that I found the gun in the river. 911. Hey, how you doing? My name's Jake. This isn't an emergency, but when I was scuba diving in the Chattahoochee River, I found a pistol, and I want to hand it over to a police officer. Okay. I tried uh, calling what the... What address are you at? Uh, I'm just right out here in front of the Whitewater Express uh, building on the Columbus side. What color and type vehicle will you be in? Uh, I'm in a Ford White Raptor, and I'm wearing okay. a uh, camo wetsuit, so you probably won't miss me. <laughs> Thank you so much, ma'am. I appreciate all, right, all your time. Bye-bye. They're having an officer come down right now. I don't know uh, how long it's going to take for the officer to come down, but we're just going to sit here in the truck, chill for a little bit, and then when the officer comes by we'll get out of the truck introduce ourselves and then we'll hand over the weapon to him but let's go ahead and uh, just I guess sit back and relax for a little bit but I'm excited man like this is cool this is what it's about you know you find something really crazy in the river and the story that some of those things can tell is just so cool like I found the gun and that gun could be used in some kind of apt active criminal case and if I hand it over to the police they could use it and what if it solved some kind of crazy case and you know they wouldn't have never solved that case without the help from me and to be able to find that weapon in a river you know like that would be such a wild experience and story so I'm sitting here waiting for the police officer and I'm looking at this gun more and more and it just really just dawns on me man the last person who had this in their hands could have potentially robbed someone and they even could have killed someone with this gun chances of this being used in a crime is very high and it's just crazy and and I'm ecstatic to be able to hand this over to the police today so I've been waiting for about an hour and a half I'm out here sweating in my wetsuit man and I was just worried that you know maybe they forgot or, or you know they just forgot to put in the order or something I'm not too sure but I gave them a call back and they told me that uh, they're just extremely busy and that they don't know how long uh, how much longer an officer would take to get here so I asked if I could just drive to the uh, the police station, so that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to go and drive over to the Columbus Police Department, hand over the weapon, and uh, I guess just walk in like this, man. I don't have any extra clothes, but it should be interesting. I don't have a bag to put this in, so I'm about to walk in the police station with a gun like this in my hand. I think we'll be okay, but we're just going to kind of go like this. <laughs> if I had a plastic bag, it would look better. <laughs> I don't know the best way to do this. All right, we're about to walk in. I'm going to ask if I could film when I'm inside. I don't want to bring the camera. Yes, ma'am. So just sit in the lobby? Okay, sounds great. Bye bye. Okay, so I guess I'm just gonna stay right here in the lobby. I'm at a police station with a gun in my wetsuit, just like chilling. <laughs> I guess they're just super, super busy. It's okay, I don't mind waiting, but I just wanna be able to give this to someone so they can use this, you know? Alright, so the guy told me to call 911 in there. I'll call 911. They told me someone's gonna go in the lobby. The guy just closed up the whole place. They told us to go wait outside. I guess I'm waiting to do, I guess. I'm really determined to get this to the police, and right now I think we've waited over three hours to just give this to someone. But it is what it is, you know, maybe everyone's super busy. So I'll wait, I don't mind. How you doing, sir? Hey, how y'all doing? I'm Jake. Steven, Steven. nice to meet you. Found a, a pistol in the river, and I want to give it to you guys. Okay. This one don't look too bad, though. No, it looks fairly new. I think uh, maybe right here is where the serial numbers were. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we'll take care of it. Let me get a bag. Sounds good. All right, man, we got it. <laughs> What's your next step? Uh, uh, following this right here. So what we'll do is we'll take it. Obviously, we'll run it. See if there's anything we can do with it. Um, Paperwork-wise, if anything, you know, if anything's on file for the weapon, then then they'll they'll be able to tell us then. We'll log it into evidence. I'll be report down to town property. So, awesome. Thank you so thank much. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. That was awesome, man. What a great way to end the story. We got police everywhere now. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys drop a thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys are new. We're closing in on 6 million subscribers. I'd love to be able to break that crazy milestone this month. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all next time. Dude, that guy kind of looked like me a little bit, didn't he? He looked kind of like an older brother. Bigger brother. Yeah, yeah like a bigger brother. <laughs>